hero sword I made from popsicle sticks. After making the Goblin King sword last year, I knew I had to make a polar opposite, so I made the hero sword. Let's check it out. Started the hero sword by cutting a tip and a handle and creating a handguard and some settings for some jewels. I found some pieces to create handguards and the hilt for the sword. Start, we're really starting to come together. This is how I did the scabber. I created a box shape. This would be sanded down and the seams filled with cornstarch and super glue. Here's a better look at the scabber. I picked out some jewels for the sword. Two rose ones for the blade. Two blue ones for the handguard. A diamond for the hilt. And another diamond for the scabber. Here's the scabber, almost complete. All the seams are filled with super glue and cornstarch. I sealed the wood with this multi-purpose sealer. It helps the paint adhere better. I painted the blade with sterling silver acrylic paint. Scabber handguard and hilt was painted with this uh, 24 karat um, gold acrylic paint, extreme sheen. And now it's complete. I used some gold chain to create the belt loop where it would hang off a belt and set a stone in the scabber. The handle is wrapped with a satin ribbon. This would be considered a broadsword. You can see the rose jewel and the two blue jewels. And then the diamond jewel and the hilt. The sword is almost a hand and a half. Almost reminds me of Zelda's power sword. Maybe it does a little. I really like how the gold paint and the silver paint complement each other. Really makes it look like a hero sword. I cut a little area in the scabber for the sword to fit down into. Little half moon sections. I think it turned out really nice. Unfortunately, the super glue kind of left some residue on the scabber and a little bit on these stones. I've been trying to clean off the stones with some uh, acetone. In all, it was an easy project. I might make more of these broadswords. I think they really turned out nice. Thanks for checking it out. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Leave a comment, ask questions. Thank you for watching. And remember to collect, inspire, and create.